this place Dante's Inferno The Devil's Maze It's a good world Hey guys, Justin here, back with another video. Um, today we are going to try to combat one of, I wouldn't really call it an issue, but probably a con to most people, and that is the heat that is generated within the cab. Uh, my roof is not in yet, so riding around for me is not so bad, because I don't have that roof, but I have heard that as soon as you put that roof on there, kind of close that cab off, man it gets toasty and i know from just riding and the miles that i've put on it and the hours that i've put on it that it does indeed get hot do i think this step today is going to be a 100 percent fix no i do not um, i have some other stuff on order that will be here this weekend kind of try to finish out what i plan on doing so what we're going to use today is from design engineering inc or dei titanium exhaust wrap and then their stainless locking tie and toolkit so it's not sponsored i bought this from my local auto zone just fyi the exhaust is going to be located back up under here my hope is that i can get in there and wrap that without having to take the bed off so if I do have to take the bed off, it's not that hard, but I'd rather not if I don't have to. So, and I feel like there's probably enough room for me to move around in there. So I'll show you right where we're at here. So there's the exhaust and it runs. Back down and under there. and then into the muffler. I also have a new exhaust tip coming, two inch outlet, um, a different kind of uh, spark arrester. So the muffler shouldn't be so restricted after the tip. It's from uh, Whiskey Bent uh, Metalworks Power Sports. So I would also like to add that I am not a mechanic. I am not a professional. Um, this I have never done in my life. You know, maybe this video will help you out and maybe, you know, you might not feel like you're a very mechanical person, but maybe this is uh, something that you could easily do yourself too, save you, save you a little bit of money. So let's uh, dive into this thing. Okay, on second thought, I think I am going to go ahead and remove the bed. It's just going to make my life a whole lot easier. I'll sure do that real fast. There are pins right there. And there's one on this side as well, right there, and there's one right there. Pull those three pins out and um, take the bed off, make everything much, much easier to get to. Okay, so now as you can see, bed is off, giving us much easier access. Honestly, to pull the three pins is really not that difficult. I was just being lazy and didn't want to do it. So here, let me just show you how much easier this is to get to now. So that's what we're going to do. We're going to wrap that guy right there. Okay, so what I'm going to do is I'm going to unwind this a little bit. And I'm going to see how far gives me one loop right i'm gonna go a little bit over and i'm gonna see how many loops this is gonna take me so one two three so i'm gonna guess about 17. i'm gonna go a couple over um just to be sure so I'm gonna go and fold this off. Okay, so we've got this cut now. We're just gonna start kind of loosely wrapping this thing. 
That way, while we're working on it, we're not having to mess with this big giant um, piece of material. Just easier to get it all on there. And then button it up after. So as you can see, we've got it wrapped back to the muffler. So now let's just uh, put the bed back on and uh, let's test her out, see if it's uh, a little bit more tolerable and some less heat. Okay, so we're all buttoned up and put back together. Um, I apologize for not shooting a whole lot of the buttoning up and finishing process. I was super sweaty and gross and you don't wanna see any of that. So now it's time to test it out, see if it's uh, better or what the deal is. Okay, so it's been about three days since we did the heat wrap. Just to let you know, the first time you start this after you do the heat wrap, You can lift your bed, lift your bed, and just let the, uh, you'll see it smoking a lot. Just let that finish, you'll see it start at the beginning closest to the motor and actually work itself on down. It's really kind of cool. Don't, don't be alarmed, that's supposed to happen. Um, it's been about three days. I've been testing it out a little bit. I didn't want to just do it on the first day and, you know, it be a mental thing. But the heat wrap on the exhaust makes a world of difference. Does it eliminate the heat? Not completely, but it definitely makes it much, much more tolerable. We've got a big day ahead of me today. I'm taking this whole thing apart. Well, not the whole thing, I guess, but I'm taking a lot of this apart. I've got more heat shield stuff coming. It's basically dynamat that we're gonna line the insides with. I'll try to figure out a way to block that heat from coming up front if possible. Um, I have rock lights to install. I want to talk about suspension, uh, preload adjustment, air pressure, that sort of thing. I have a winch stopper, a few other things. Also, I want to go over um, a couple things that the dealership did not do to this um, or things that it was missing, little clips here and there. Kind of some stuff for you to keep an eye out for. Uh, I do, the dealership that I got it from, the people were great. Tom Wood in, uh, in Anderson, Indiana. And they, they're amazing people, great. And I'm sure if I just called them, they would absolutely handle it and take care of it. So I haven't done an initial review or first impressions video yet, just because I don't feel like I know enough about it yet. This is my very, very first uh, UTV that I've ever had. I've always had, you know, ATVs or dirt bikes, um, never had a UTV. So I want to, I'll go over why I chose this one, you know, what I like about it, things I don't like about it, things that I would change, things I would do differently if I knew what I know now, and that sort of thing. Look for that, that'll be coming soon. Uh, thank you so much for watching. Please uh, hit that subscribe button and hit that bell notification and we will uh, see you soon.